Welcome to another episode of Pressed Start to Play and we are playing some Nintendo and you may recognise it. Going back in years to the good old 8 bits and a bit of Double Dragon. And I haven't played this in absolutely years. So let's see if I can uh, get the uh, the gist of it again. Oh, oh dear! Controls are absolutely awful. Probably not one of the better looking NES games. Simple fact of, for example, the incredible Hulk-coloured guy I'm currently. Oh, just. Getting my ass whipped by. That's right, son of a bitch. Oh yeah, give me the thumb. Of course, this is an arcade port. Quite a few on the NES. Probably one of the better known ones. Ooh. Yeah, whip you, motherfucker. All right, all right. Uh, back off. There we go. Get down. Oh. I think you play this game. Yeah, that's right. Oh. Get back. Nice roundhouse kick there. As I said, I haven't played this for year, absolutely years. You can still kind of remember the level design and stuff like that. I'm picking that bad boy up again. You! Hate how it takes like a couple of seconds when you were. Uh... Oh, nice uppercut. When you were. Uh, you jump and you land, you kind of like stop for a second. Oh, she actually dropped her bra then. Yeah, whip you! Music's quite good. Never really paid attention to it previously. Come on, get up. Yeah, get down. Yeah. Loving it. Uh, let's just get use this. Get this whip going. I think this has got to be one of the most ported arcade or games. I can remember vaguely playing it on the CPC 464. Well, it's a whole new video, but. Backgrounds are quite good for an NES game. Oh, oh that was nice. Shoved me straight in the middle of it, then. Oh. Yeah, everything's quite easy. The, obviously, the character sprites have uh, took the cane in. Not exactly the best, are they? Jesus, massive! Can I kick somebody down? I don't think I need to. That's it, bitch. I own you. Yeah. When you realise, I think I'm getting extra like hit points or something when uh, I get a certain score. Oh, this dude's... Get down. That's it. Flash. That's sounding nice. I like that. Mission do. <laughs> oh, man. Every time I go to punch... Whoa. That was a nice... Oh, I can do that as well. Yes. Every day's a school day. Let's pick up this box of TLC. Oh, I can't. I'm stuck. Ninja. Ah, there we go. Oh, right. They hit me, I drop it. I hit them, they throw it still. Ah, there we go. That roundhouse again. These two dudes are like rock hard. Die. That's right, my cardboard box hits you in the shin! Ah, 
Oh, my box just disappeared. Kick you in the booze. Sure, you know I don't think I put. Oh, well, that was clever of you, Matt. I can't. I don't give the NES, like, as much time as I probably should. It tends to be one of the la last consoles I go to. Kind of, uh. The arcade was more my kind of thing, and then uh, like PlayStation, PlayStation 2. But I was always a Master System kid when like this Kira came on. I started, obviously started off with the CPC 464, and uh, like I mentioned in the the Master System, you know that was my first console. What? Get down. That was my first kind of console, so, well, not kind of console, you know, the Mass System was my first console. And, uh, being British and growing up, I had a CPC 464, you know, we were a computers, coding books and stuff, which I still don't really do anything with. Let's see if I can get down here without dying this time. Well, we're good, and I got a baseball bat. Get down! Right kick. Oh yes, lovely. Oh, that's gonna blow up. But um, but yeah, I was always a Master System kind of child. I preferred the games. They were a bit more. Well, I'd say I prefer the games. Obviously, being my first system, it'll always have that kind of place in my heart. Because the Nintendo kind of doesn't. I never bought a Nintendo like later on when I was kind of buying the consoles and stuff myself. Yeah, that's right. Go on, get up. I get down. Now they're going to get there before me, aren't they? Yeah, right, okay. I'll have you. Get off. Yeah, and you. Get off. Bye bye. It's good music. With that nice crash in the background. Right. I've got a feeling something's gonna jump out on me in a minute. Very quiet coming up these stairs. Ah. Yeah, rocking the two hit combo then. Boom. Sit down. I'm getting good. Don't know, like, blow my own trumpet or anything, but you know. I'm the double dragon Dawson. Whoa! I'm gonna get my ass kicked now to that. Yeah. Yeah! On it! Sorry if you can hear some squeaking, that's my uh, my chair. <laughs> really need to get a new one. And now we're all of a sudden we're in a forest. Oh, nice. Yeah, ooh! That's gotta have hurt. I love how you throw a knife and it's uh, absolutely devastating. One hit dead. They hit with a baseball bat and they'll get up fine. Yeah! Okay, yeah, must be every like, I don't know, 5,000 points or something? I get a, uh... oh no. I remember this game being a lot harder. I don't think, it's, I think this is probably the furthest I've ever gotten this game, to be honest. Oh 
I'm not too keen on the music on this level. Wasn't he just a boss on the previous level? Oh no, the music is absolutely mental. That's a bit better. Repetitive, but uh, it works. Oh, he says, get down. Ah, oh, that was a new one. I hadn't done that before. In the face. Oh, he still wants some more. Oh no. Oh, I think I may have actually just nearly lost a life. Straight in. Let's bring him back over here. Oh. oh well. There we go. Mode A per one player. Um yeah, so just a very quick one, an update, a bit of uh, game footage and some chat about Double Dragon and kind of my experience with the NES. We've got some other games on. I think I'm gonna give um Metal Gear a game, uh, maybe Tailspin, I'm going to maybe the Bomberman, Castlevania, NBA Jam on the Super Nintendo, uh, Gunstar Heroes, some Star Trek Simpsons on the uh, the Mega Drive, and I've also got a video coming up as well of Mad Shark on the arcades and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Turtles in Time. So thanks for, uh, for listening and watching, please drop us a like and subscribe, and uh, I'll see you soon.